Last time on Ending Up Anywhere, after a three-week road trip around Corsica, we caught the ferry back to the mainland. Um, right, so we're um, 45 kilometres away from Borg San Maris. Um, that's going to take us an hour and 11 minutes because we're winding our way up through um, the Alps. Um, Italian fuel stations have caused us a few uh, headaches along the way. Um, because we haven't been able to get any fuel, um, we pulled uh, off the motorway to um, one that looked like it was going to be quite cheap, um, but it didn't have anywhere to insert a credit card, and nor was the shop manned. Um, and we think that um, maybe you needed to have a mobile phone app or something to be able to get fuel there. Um, and then the SO just up the road um, just didn't take credit cards. Um, but we have got enough fuel to get us up to Borg St. Maurice. Um, and it looks like when we get there, there are um, two supermarkets um, with fuel stations. Um, so hopefully we can work those out. Um, right, so it's um, our first morning in Bourg Saint Maurice, and we're going to catch the uh, what kind of railway? Funicular. That's the one. Funicular railway. Um, up there somewhere. And then we're going to walk down. Um, don't really know what kind of temperature to prepare for, so I've got my shorts with my zip off legs. Uh, just in case. Tend has gone for long sleeves, and I think it's not so cold that <laughs> I, I wish I had. During the summer months you'll find skiers have been replaced by cyclists. So we got the funicular railway up to uh, Le Arc 1600 and um, we've just been to the tourist office to ask for a walking map and um, spoke to a very nice lady there who uh, recommended some walks and um, so we're walking up from 1600 metres to 1950 metres um, which should take us somewhere over there I think. Um, and from there uh, we can walk back down to Borg St. Marie or get a courtesy bus.
sleeves totally not necessary because it's uh, actually really warm. And, and this is a really nice walk actually. Walk a bit steep to start with, it's levelled out. And the sun's just uh, peeping between the pine trees. It's really nice, lovely fresh mountain air. Lots of exercise. thousand four hundred and ninety seven meters now and our legs ache and we need a bus. We're on the bus. We caught it by a whisker, he was just pulling away and walked um, stopped and very kindly opened the doors for us. So the bus goes back down to um, 1600, um, which is where we got the burning key up, key up, burning key up to. So we just need to go shoot our way back down from there to Port St. Marie's. So we're waiting at the train station because we've cycled for about an hour downhill to Decathlon um, and don't fancy the cycle back uphill. So um, we've paid seven euros for two adults and um, we don't know if we're allowed to take bikes or not. Um, so we'll see there is somebody else here with a bike. So whether we needed to pay more for a ticket and if there's a special carriage we need to go on, we just don't know. But we will soon find out. Hello. Um, right, so yesterday we um, managed to um, get our bikes on the train. We don't know whether we should have added um, bikes to our ticket. There didn't seem to be any option for that. Nobody asked for our tickets, so it was fine. We got home in 15 minutes. It's now quarter to 11 on Sunday and we are five minutes from our next campsite which is Hotopia Atangdu Fuchi or something like that. Um, it's going to rain later, um, there didn't seem to be anywhere in France we could have gone to avoid that. Um, so we should have about five hours once we arrive before it rains um, and then it seems like it's going to rain all night, um, stopping by about seven o'clock tomorrow morning. Um, anyway, um, rain doesn't matter if you're swimming in the lake, I don't suppose. Um, so we've had very good weather really for a month, so we can't complain. Um, three minutes to go to our next campsite. So it's about 
about quarter to twelve. We're um, ready pitched and um, just off into the town. Um, the shop's open till one, so we can perhaps get some vegetables for dinner um, and then go and have a look at the town. around the lake it doesn't take very long only about half an hour um, but we found um, a quite a useful map that um, details a couple of uh, walks which um, we might tackle tomorrow um, one of them is 12 kilometers um, and goes from one lake to another lake to an even smaller lake alongside a river um, it comes back again obviously um, a bit confusing because this map's upside down. Fortunately the forecast rain held off until early evening but then it really hailed. The sun came out the next day for our walk around the three lakes. <laughs> 